Time to make one of these. Hey folks, welcome back to my channel. Uh, sorry to tease you a little bit the other day, but I didn't leave you hanging too long. So I thought what we'd do today is make the pen. Um, I do reckon these are gonna come out quite nice. If you didn't watch that video, then um, it is somewhere around here. I'll stick it somewhere. But it was basically making a matchstick pen blank, uh, or blanks, so that we can make a cool matchstick pen. And as you can see, it's all set in resin kind of nice and that's kind of how it's going to look I reckon once the pen's um, been made. So um, I'm quite excited to see how this is going to come out. Um, I've no idea how it's going to look but I reckon it's going to look really quite funky. So uh, let's get on and make this pen. So I've sanded this back now from 150 all the way to 800 grit um, and I've used these, uh, just used these pads as well, I think they're called Abrolon pads or something like that. Started off at 500, 1000, 2000, 4000. Um, so it's pretty smooth now. What we're going to do now is apply some CA glue, so a nice CA glue finish which is basically super glue in the UK um, and that's going to bring it out really nice. So uh, let's get on with the CA glue.
that. That is looking pretty neat. Now the only thing, the only issue that I can see at the moment is because of the the, the resin is quite clear and you can see uh, obviously through the, to the barrel. Now we did have this issue a little while ago and I have bought some um, white barrels uh, and there's obviously different ways that you could probably get over having to put super glue in here because the super glue if you can see is left like a bit of a misty white in there which is not brilliant um, but actually looks pretty cool I think it's going to look quite a really funky looking pen it's just a little bit of a shame we've got some sort of white mist in there but I still think that this is going to look alright so uh, let's finish this off <laughs> Actually kind of like it although a little bit disappointed about the uh, bits of white inside there I don't know if you can see those uh, which obviously from the super glue that I put in I probably could have avoided that and I think what I'll do is I'll do another one um, and I'll do that differently I'll either put the barrel in with some epoxy resin which may well work a lot better or we'll use a white barrel but I'm not sure if a white barrel actually have the same effect or not but I don't know it's all right it looks good I don't know I'm pretty happy with it but I say it's um and again it's fairly thick as well this one but I think I think I do like the thicker pens I think they do look quite nice but the uh, but it, it does show you that the blanks work okay they do come out quite well and you've got yourself a little matchstick pen so, uh, so I hope you enjoyed watching that Sorry to keep you hanging, even if it was just for one day. Um, and I uh, hope you enjoyed watching. Um, so that was it, just a quick mini series of some blanks that I'm making at the moment. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching those. I've got a few other ideas to put into some blanks and make some other pens from. Stick with me, thanks very much for uh, joining me for, for today's video. Uh, thanks very much to all my new subscribers as always. And thanks very much to all my old ones for hanging around. So uh, I'll put some stills up at the end for this and uh, hope to see you all very soon. Take care, cheers.